Hello, Skidaway families. It is December 19th. We are so close to Christmas. I can already taste the cookies and cocoa that I'm going to put out for Santa. You know you got to do a taste test, right? Anyway, so as we get closer to Christmas, I just get more and more excited. And that's exactly what happens in our Bible verse for tonight. It comes from Luke chapter 2 verses 11 and 12 and it says the angel still talking to the shepherds said today your savior was born in David's town. Remember that's what they called Bethlehem because that's where King David was from. Anyway he is Christ the Lord. This is how you will know him. You will find a baby wrapped in claws in place in a manger. Wow. He's finally here. You know, we've been preparing for our hearts for Christmas for a long time, for 19 days to be exact, with our family devotionals. There are 25 days before you get to Christmas. How would you feel if you had been waiting for 2,000 years? What about 4,000 years? That would be a long time to wait, right? Well, Jesus has been promised. He got promised thousands of years before he was ever even born. Crazy, right? Well, see, God has a master plan and everything works out to his timing. So my question for us as a family tonight is, what do you do when you are excited? Imagine this is the very first Christmas and you've been waiting 2,000 years. Your grandparents told you about it because their grandparents told it about them and it's just passed down and finally, finally it's here. You've seen an angel of God so you know it's got to be true. He's told you it's really good news and hello, it's really good news so you take off running, right? Well, that's exactly my question is what do you do when you get exciting, exciting news? And how do you think geez, the shepherds felt when they found out Jesus had finally been born. Go ahead and pause the video right here and talk it over with your family. I hope you guys had a great discussion with your family and I hope your hearts got all excited all over again getting ready for Christmas. Let's pray. Jesus, thank you that you are such an awesome gift that we can get excited about it. Thank you that the shepherds got excited about it. Help us to know that you are the whole reason for the season and that you are just a great and good and wonderful God. We love you. Amen. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.